Hi everyone, this is Deb Tim, a Canadian girl, and welcome to Deb's Musings. I'm having a lot of fun with this vlog, and if you have any topics you would like me to look into or share my thoughts on, let me know, because I would love to do that for you. Today, I'm sharing my thoughts on keeping score, so please stay tuned. This aquarium that will be the background for this video was my very first African cichlid aquarium. I bought it as a complete set, 40 gallons on a homemade stand, including the cichlids. I was told they were all mbuna, and I had no idea even what an mbuna was. But I loved it, and I was so excited to finally have my African cichlids. So in this video, you'll see my red top Hongi in breeding mode, trying hard to impress his girl. So please enjoy. Why is it that some people feel life is a scorecard? Can you imagine if you sat with a paper and pen and tried to record every favor that was done for you? Who you owed a favor to or who owes you? Life shouldn't be like that, but we often hear the phrase, you owe me. Have you ever offered to help someone and they look at you as if you have two heads? They may wonder why would you help me if you had an agenda or what you might expect in return? Finding it hard to believe someone would offer to help without strings attached. I think it's time we take on the don't keep score philosophy of life. I myself find it gratifying helping others where I can make a difference in their lives. My only purpose would be in gaining trust and respect and helping out in any way I can. It's really a win-win situation. In helping someone, they win by benefiting from the help offered and immediate improvement, and you win by feeling good inside. Although the intent is not instant gratification, later it comes in good feelings of giving something of you in simple kindness. That in itself is worth the effort. That's really what it's all about, isn't it? Paying it forward. It will benefit co-workers, family, friends, but most importantly, people around us who could really use the help. Acts of kindness in the pay-it-forward sense often encourage others to continue the trend, just giving without keeping score for no other reason than wanting to be helpful. Paying it forward is such a simple premise. Anyone can do it. Just remember the old saying, what goes around comes around. So until next time, this is Deb Tim signing out. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, I also encourage you to leave a comment as to what your thoughts are on this topic or any topics you'd like me to cover, and I would be more than happy to do that for you. So I will be talking to you soon. Bye.